We're redefining what an ortho meeting should be like, and it's in Vegas, okay? Not only will this meeting give you the best year of your life from practice perspective, you might even have some of your best nights of your life because it's in Vegas and what we're gonna have in store for you. You know you wanna go. So many of you reached out and said, I'm, I'm gonna go, oh, I'll buy tickets, I'm gonna go. Right now, there's 150 tickets available at, at the lowest price they will ever be for 150 doctor, 150 team. Hello there, everybody, and welcome to another episode of Your 5-Minute Friday. I'm your host, Dr. Glenn Krieger, and today it's going to be short and sweet. There's something you're all doing that drives us all crazy, and I don't quite understand it, and you're leaving money on the table. What is it? There are meetings, there are get-togethers, there's things that cost money, and orthodontists wait and wait and wait. I'll give you an example. Right now, Orthopreneur Summit 2025, first clinical orthopreneurs meeting, Ron Ronconi, Tom Pitts, Maz Moshiri, Diego Pedro... Um, you know, Stuart Frost, I could just go on and on, Dan Bills, John Graham, teaching clinical and, um, and leadership skills, management. We have four tracks each. I mean, this is the meeting. We're redefining what an ortho meeting should be like, and it's in Vegas, okay? Not only will this meeting give you the best year of your life from practice perspective, you might even have some of your best nights of your life because it's in Vegas and what we're going to have in store for you. But my point on all of this is, you know you want to go. So many of you reached out and said, I'm, I'm going to go, oh, I'll buy tickets, I'm going to go. Right now, there's 150 tickets available at, at the lowest price they will ever be for 150 doctor, 150 team. At Summit, when we do Summit, we usually sell a couple of hundred tickets. Once we sell the first 150, it goes up $200. When we sell the next 150, it goes up another $200. When the next 150 are sold, it goes up another $200. So why are you waiting? Why are you waiting to pay intentionally an additional $200, $400, or $600 for every doctor and team pass you're going to buy. Explain it to me. It makes zero sense to me. Because I've had so many of you reach out to me and say, oh, I'm signing up. I'm, I'm going to do it in a, in a couple of weeks. And I'm telling you, in a couple of weeks, it's going to be $200 more. Guaranteed. No questions asked. So why, why do you do this every single year? It's not just now. It was in 2018, 19, 20, 22, 23, 24. You do it every single year. Why don't you just go tell your spouse, I'm going to be gone for these two or three days or come with me to Vegas. We're going to have a fun time for two or three days. Put it in the calendar, book out the days, buy the tickets, which are cheaper now than they ever will be. Book your hotel room, which is like $189 a night at Caesars Palace, which is crazy. And go to a meeting and make your year the best year it'll be. Or do the alternative. Don't tell your spouse, don't tell anybody, don't tell your team, don't change the schedule. And then two months before the meeting, when you realize, oh my God, everybody's going to this meeting and I should go too. You have too many patients in the schedule. Your spouse says you need to be home, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. And you end up not going. You've got to take CE and this is going to be clinical and management. Some of the best CE you'll ever take in your life. Why are you not signed up for I just don't understand it. It blows me away because that's not how I ever operated. When a meeting comes available, I sign up right away if I plan on going. So, and, and, don't, and again, please, God bless you all. I love you all. And, and there are very rare circumstances where the following is not true, but you can be gone from your family for three days in a year from now. You can. How do I know? Because I did it. I have tons of people I know who do it. I don't care if you're the mom or the dad. You give somebody a year's notice, you can work this one out. And for the people who are going to be on that stage and the people you're going to be around... I'm just telling you, find a babysitter. You're not pregnant yet, okay? You're not expecting because this is a year from now. So unless you're really good, uh, you don't know what's going on in the future in that respect. I would book this trip and bring a spouse, bring a loved one, or come alone and have a great time. But opsummit2025.com. If you plan on going, I'm trying to save you money. Sign up now. Much love to each and every one of you.